Hey Free Faces, it's Clary Berry and I just wanted to chat with you for a second today. I think I've checked in. This morning was a little bit different. Um, slept in for a school day, kind of, and I totally forgot to grab my juice. I have backup water in my um, bag too. I'm just loving the backpack. I have recently switched over, didn't want to be a handbag basic bitch anymore, so I thought I'd do that. I might give you guys a bag tour soon, so let me know if that would be something that you're interested in. What's in my bag? What's in my purse? How I have it organized? Everything like that. Um, just wanted to show you what I did have for breakfast. It was very small, probably even just a standard serving almost. No, probably two. Two servings of pineapples. These are new for me. I just saw these at Costco. They are organic and unsulfured. They are very interesting. When you first pull them out, they look like some like little flower. They remind me of like some chrysanthemum flowers. Let me get you some other ones here so you can see these. I'm going to go ahead and put these on my little leggies here. Look how cute they are. There's a little better. Yes, for sure. They're just so interesting and, it, you know, they're interesting looking, but they're also really interesting flavored as well. I mean, it's not just a straight up pineapple. It's got a nice depth to it, which I just really love. And I think these are definitely some of my favorites. Between these and mangoes, I am good. So I'm going to have to make sure Costco knows that I can't live without that type of stuff anymore. No added sugar even. Yeah, and that's what I'm... Ugh can't even eat any other type of dried pineapple. This is just so different. It's, it was such a such a welcome change from all the other dried stuff that I've ever had. So yeah, I am going to go to an advising appointment. Just got home from school a little while ago. Going to have to walk that rocky dog. Walk that rocky dog. Oh man, he must be tired. <laughs> And yeah, get some videos up for you guys and got practice later. It's going to be a uh, not too much of a busy day, but busy enough. We'll tell you guys what I eat later. Hey, Fruit Faces. I just got back from a run. We actually did a little just, I mean, not even probably a third of a mile. Just real quick, you know, 10 minutes, break a sweat. It's better than walking him when the weather's so nice like this. And then, of course, I come back. And my appetite's ready to go, you know. So I got leftovers, basically. Again, this is cooked squash. It is cooked beans. But I still feel like the majority of my meal is raw. And so this fits the bill for me. It feels really great to digest. I've never had a problem with beans. But it's very refreshing. There was just a red sauce, garlicky, you know, Italian herb marinara. But then I actually added some sweet chili sauce in there for some extra kick. And roasted red pepper flakes. It's good. I think it's just a really great idea, especially at the beginning of the week. You know you have a busy week. Go ahead and make some extra things up so that you have great foods to fall back on that can last you numerous days, honestly. But it's always just good because I feel like, at least with me, I get hungry so fast. It's a fine line between, and eh, not so hungry, maybe I'll wait a few minutes to eat or get trapped, and then bam, where's the food, need the food. And um, having stuff already prepared is just such a blessing to keep yourself on track because a lot of the times the quick stuff I would go for to get off track, savory, it, mostly it was savory because I always had quick stuff for, for the sweet flavor. But it was like I would always grab hummus. I would always grab some sort of chips or rice cake or something that I didn't want. And now I have all of my bases covered. Mm. So I just finished that off and it was really good, especially down towards the bottom. I got some really good spices and flavors and um, I feel amazing. I just want to highlight that because it's so easy to get in this raw groove and it's like, oh, I feel normal after eating. But when you compare it to how you used to feel even after eating cooked foods, vegan foods, it's like, all right, now I'm totally ready to go to my academic advising meeting. Really, I am. So yeah, I'm gonna get ready to go get advised. 
Hey guys, I just got back from my advisor. Learned a lot, a lot of hard work still to be done, but that's all right. We'll just keep plugging away at it like we always do. Just wanted to let you know, I came home and ate a whole bag of the best kale chips ever. <laughs> I really need to ask them if they will send me these in bulk. I have not tried the pumpkin spice though. Have you guys tried that? Has anybody tried that one?